We are under the lights as the show gets you ready for another edition of Major League Baseball. Tonight, we've got a good matchup in store between the L.A. Dodgers and the St. Louis Cardinals. Stepping in, Justin Turner. He'll get us started in this one under the lights. One one home is looked at for ball number two. Fouled off. Not the warmest night you'll see around here, and even 50 degrees at game time. Three and two now. Corey Seeger will be next. And he lays off ball four, and the leadoff man is on to begin the ball game. Here's Corey Seager. He's ready for his first at bat of this early season contest. Back up the middle. Wong has it. The second for one. On to first, and they get them both. Next up for Los Angeles, Mookie Betts. And if you remember, he took home a Silver Slugger Award for AL Outfielders a year ago. Two and one now to Mookie. Hasn't seen a heater yet in this at bat. One might be coming right here. Popped him up. And he'll get under it to put it away in foul territory, and that ends the inning. Here's the second baseman, Colton Wong. He'll lead things off here in the bottom half of the first. Into the windup, ready with the payoff pitch. Ground ball, foul down the left side. He'll try it again, three and two. going to be back to some serious T work if he can't put that pitch in play right in his wheelhouse. Donnie finally wears him down here as he strikes him out after a nine pitch at bat. Here's Dexter Fowler now. He's back in the starting lineup for this one after sitting out last night's game. And a fastball but he's losing it a bit here to three and one now. And he missed with that one. It's ball four. A one-out walk here in the home first. The next to bat for St. Louis, Paul Goldschmidt. And he's definitely off to a fast start in the early part of the season. To two balls and two strikes now. We all know he's a really good hitter, and this is probably a good example why. He fell behind 0-2, but knowing they're probably going to try to get him to chase the pitcher's pitch, he got really... And the throw to first is there. The inning is over. Cody Bellinger at the plate now. He went deep in the contest last night. Good battle. Count remains full. A payoff pitch one more time. Bounce to the right into the loaded up infield. DeYoung fields it cleanly. And the off balance throw gets him. Nice play for the out. So one away here with the bases empty. And that'll bring up the big bat of Max Muncy. Still looking for our first hit in the ball game. Popped him up. And he'll stay with it to put it away as they get their man here for the second out. So next to bat will be the left-handed hitting Jock Peterson. First at bat for him in this one. He was one for four with a double in the ball game last night. Now he lifts a high pop-up. Drifting into foul territory on the right side. And Goldschmidt will make the catch, and that ends the inning.
Here's Matt Carpenter. He's coming off a three hit performance in the loss last night. Set to deal on two and two. Swing and a miss on the fastball, and that's the first out. Stepping in for the Cardinals, Paul DeYoung. Lifetime against this particular arm. He's gone two for eight. No offer on that one. Two balls and a strike. Bueller has both great strikeout stuff and exceptional command on the mound to go with it. A rare combination, but one that makes him one of the best in our sport. Matty V, you talked about it. He doesn't walk a whole lot of guys. Well, if you don't walk a lot of guys, that means you have to throw the ball. And he tries for the backhand reach at third, but he gets by the glove down the line. Into the box, Yadier Molina. Breaking ball well inside and taken for ball three. And he misses here for ball four. Already two walks surrendered in his first couple of innings of work. Now at the plate, Tyler O'Neill. He's two for seven in the series so far. One and two as he chases the slider. You chase a pitch that bad outside the zone, you've got to find a way to regroup. Adjust the batting gloves. Only look over the hard row 17 inches. There's one. Throw to Muncie to finish the double play. That retires the side. Top of the third set to get underway. Next for the Dodgers, Will Smith. And he's definitely off to a fast start in the early part of the season. Look into Molina, now the 1-1. One, one. And he'll miss the target there with a the curveball, and it's 2-1 and one now. 2-2 two and two to the Dodgers catcher. This pitch is popped up. Carpenter is under it. One down. Now batting, Thank Zach you. McKinstry. He's ready for his first at bat of this early season contest. From the windup, the 1 1 pitch. And there's a fastball well off the plate inside. And a fastball in the dirt that's taken for a ball. One thing that could nag at you as a pitcher is having to work really hard to get a guy that you think you should be able to cruise right through. He's not known for his offensive prowess, but he's putting together a real nice at bat here. Got it back in time there, and it's two and one. Great decision there to pull back. Step number one in getting a sacrifice bunt down. Make sure you bunt a pitch that you can handle. And they'll try to stay out of the double play here as he lays this one down. And the off-balance throw beats him at first, and that's a tough play. So it's back to the top of the order now, and that'll bring up the third baseman, Justin Turner. That's a hit, the first in this game for the Dodgers. But this is well up the line, and he's safe at home plate. The batter, number five, shortstop, Corey. Into the box Seager. now, Corey Seager. And the throw to Wong, and the inning is over. So striding in, Lane Thomas. In eight at-bats in the series, he's collected three hits. Now the 2-1 pitch. Doesn't hit the target. It's ball three. You can bet they'd love ball four here. That gives the pitcher on deck an obvious bunt situation to move the runner into scoring position. Three and two, full count. Popped up. Muncie waits on it, and that's the first out of the inning. 
Next to hit will be the pitcher, Miles Michaelis. One-one. Pretty good pitch right there. Fastball in off the plate. One of the things you want to do as a pitcher, try to stand those hitters up. Hit back up the middle. And that'll get on through into center, and he's got himself a one-out hit. Now back, second baseman, Colt Dan. So now to the plate, Colton Wong. Fly ball out to straightaway right. Bellinger is there to put it away, and the runner will be forced to retreat back to first. So the runner at first here with two gone in the inning, and that'll bring in the switch hitting outfielder Dexter Fowler. Now the one and one pitch fouled away. Michaelis leads off first with a pair of outs in the inning. A knuckle curve there, and he thought he had him, but it's two and two. Trying to nibble here, and he misses to run it full now. Three and two. Good running count right here. Three balls, two strikes, two outs, run run first. He'll be off to the races on this pitch. Oh, that's well hit. Deep center field. Back goes Peterson. Now this will rattle up against the wall. And that's going to land out toward the wall out there. And the score is the runner from first. It's one to one. Now back. The first base Stepping in now, Paul Goldschmidt. And that misses, ball four. So it's first and second now with two out. Stepping in and ready for another shot, Matt Carpenter. Two on, two out for him here in the third. The set and the one-two. This is a huge pitch right here. I don't think he wants to go three-two and have those runners be in motion. Look for him to be aggressive with what he thinks is his best pitch right now. Too high. Ball three. There's a swing and a high deep drive headed for the right field corner. And nearly a three run shot. Instead it's a foul ball. He set the three two. Full count still. On the eighth pitch of the at bat is the one that finally does it as he wears him down and the inning is over. All set for the start of the fourth. Stepping into the box, Mookie Betts. The 2 1 home. Hard on the ground towards short. DeYoung's got it. Throw to first in time, one gone here in the fourth. So the bases are empty with one man gone. And that'll bring forward Cody Bellinger. Here's the one and one pitch. Hard hit towards center. Thomas is there. Two gone. So bases are empty here with two gone. And that'll bring up the left-handed hitter Max Muncy. It's fouled away. The next 3 2. Hit hard up the middle. DeYoung gathers it in. And he'll make that play look easy as the throw is in time to end the inning. So Paul DeYoung digs in next. One for one after a single this first time up. 1-1. Yeah. Strike two, swinging. Usually you see chases outside the zone on off-speed stuff like sliders, breaking balls, and change-ups. But to chase a fastball that far outside the zone tells me this hitter's not seeing it well at all. And a base hit, so early trouble to lead off the inning. Now batting, Hector. Yeah, yeah. 
And now, Yadier Molina. Tough to do much with that one. A swing and a miss. Hey, you know the pitcher right now, he's looking for that best friend, that double play ball. This is where you have to really be disciplined at the plate and make sure that you get a pitch that's above the knees that you can get in the air. Digging in now, Tyler O'Neill. Ground ball to second. This could be two. Reined in. One there. But he'll put this in his pocket and be content with just the one out. Sliding into the box, Lane Thomas. He popped out in his first trip. Now a throw over, and the runner back easily. The 2 1. Sometimes it can be difficult for a pitcher. You're facing a guy that's not known to be a big stick in the lineup. Sometimes the toughest thing is to be aggressive and throw strikes. Out in front there as this one's pulled off to the left side. Now the payoff pitch home. Popped up. And he will make the catch back there as they're a step closer to getting out of this with two away now. So in now is the Cardinals pitcher, Miles Michaelis. He singled and scored in his first appearance in this one. Yeah, he showed like a little prowess with the bat right there, Dan. I'd be surprised if they don't attack him a little bit more carefully this A.B. And he'll get there in plenty of time to put this one away, and that ends the inning. Here's Jock Peterson now. Here's the one and one pitch. And there's a line drive. Base hit to left field. The batter, the catcher, Will Smith. At the plate, Will Smith. Got him. So digging in now, Zach McKinstry. No official at bat for him, but he has scored a run in this one. McKinstry. Oh, not cheated on that one. It's two and two. Really feels like he's just on cruise control out there on the mound right now. Boy, this is a tight one. You kind of get the feeling like the next team that scores is going to win this one. And oh, a big rip at the curveball, but he didn't get it, and he becomes the second now, casualty of the okay. inning. Walker. No offer on that one. Two balls and a strike. And he fouls this one off. Runner aboard at first here with two gone in a 1 1 ball game. Slider whiffed on for strike three. A great pitch to put an end to the inning. So the lineup flips over and digging in Colton Wong. It was a flyout for him in his last trip. Ready with the 1 1 pitch. Pulled high in the air out to right field. Bellinger's under it. One out. And now to the plate, Dexter Fowler. He'll try to follow up the double in his last oh, wow. at bat with another big hit right here. The 1 1 home. Oh, that's out. down the left field line and deep and that will end up a foul ball the 2 2 not a time to fool around right now on a 3 2 count with the middle part of the order coming up expect a good pitch to swing at tough curveball that time but he's able to make a little contact to keep this at bat going one run four hits and no errors so far for the Redbirds Sharply hit ball back up the middle. 
And that's in for a base hit. His second in as many trips to the plate. Jimmy Nelson will come on and make now his batting. fourth appearance the in this campaign. Standing in now, Paul Goldschmidt. Now this is hit not all that hard out to second. Scooped up, and an off-balance throw is in time as he takes one away. Wow! Digging in now will be Matt Carpenter. Runner in scoring position with Sugan. One run, five hits, and no errors so far for the Redbirds. And that misses off the plate and low, so it's three and one now. This is a spot you like to be in as a good hitter. Runners in scoring position and count leverage in your favor. And that misses ball four, so it's first and second now with two out. Now in the box, Paul DeYoung. And we'll see what he can do here with a pair of runners on base and two gone here in the fifth. Swing and a liner, but pulled in at the hot corner, and that ends the inning. So the batting order turns over now and set to go. Justin Turner singled home a run in his last time up. Here now the 2-2. Lofted in the air out toward right center. And he drops it. He'll get it into second. And he's safe. Hey. Now the plate, Corey Seager. He's 0 for 2 in the ballgame so far. <laughs> A runner at second, nobody out. Pulled toward right center field. On the move is Fowler. He makes the catch. A great effort to get there and record the first out of the inning. Here's Mookie Betts. He's hitless in his two at-bats so far. Runner at second here with one man out. Lays off the slider that time, two and one. So far this season with runners in scoring position, Betts averages a hit once every four at bats. An average at exactly 250. Three and one to the Dodgers left fielder. Strike two called, and it's full three and two. Great job of doubling up with a fastball inside. A lot of times you'll see a pitcher go in there, but they won't go back in there a second time. This guy's not afraid to pitch inside. Now a swing as he shoots this down the right field line. And this will hop over the wall, but the run will now score. Right fielder, Cody. At the plate Bellinger. now, Cody Bellinger. And he takes ball two, and it's two and one. like the fastball got away from him there well to me it just looks like he's really aiming the ball a little bit right now and it's funny when you do that you usually don't have as good a control as you do when you just let it go free and easy that's in there base hit and the runner from second will stay put at third so they're runners at the corners now with one away now back the first base so now to the plate, Max Muncy fouled off. The one two. Again, he sends it out of play. With one out and runners on the corners, some managers like to hit and run here. It's a little risky, but it can help you stay out of the double play if it's well executed. Still one and two. Runners are at first and third, one away. Off the plate that time and a little high. It's even at two and two. This is exactly the reason why this guy has been so successful and has played this game so long, scrambling pitch after pitch, making this guy work out on the mound. From the belt, the pitch hit hard on the ground at first. Genesis Cabrera takes the mound to try to get out of this mess. There are two on with only one away.
Into the box now. Jock Peterson. Now a chopper to second. This will be a tough turn. The second for one. On to Goldschmidt, but too late as they'll just get the one. Now that. So coming to the plate, Will Smith. And we'll see what he can do here. Two on, two away, two home so far this inning. The 1-1 one, one home. A time to start making some quality pitches. He finds himself in a tough spot behind an account with guys on base. Just off the outside that time, laid off for a ball. Here's the game within the game. You have a better matchup on deck. You got a 3-1 count in this situation. Don't be afraid to put him on base and attack the next guy. Count full, three balls and two strikes. The 3-2 pitch. It's the top of the zone. He struck him out looking. Standing in, Yadier Molina. A couple of walks for him thus far. Things not looking very good so far in this one, but we're still in the middle innings. They're down by a couple of runs, and this would be the right place and the right time to get something going. The last thing they want to do is to try to come from behind and win this one in the eighth or ninth inning. Rolled slowly down the first baseline. And good hustle to get over and tag him for the out. Striding in, Tyler O'Neill. He reached on a fielder's choice previously. Hits are even right now at five aside. Liner towards second. A leap here, but it ticks off his glove. And they'll have no play as he reaches first base safely. The center fielder, number 35. Into the box, Lane Thomas. The ball in two strikes. Now a fastball awfully close, but he doesn't get the call. It's two and two now. Working for the punch out and the offering. And a swing and a miss as they got him with the slider there. Two away. Tommy Edmund will grab a bat and hit for the pitcher here. Grounded up the first baseline, but a foul ball, one and two now. A swing and a miss as he chased with two strikes, and that will retire the side. John Brebbia is into the ball game now as he'll make his fifth appearance of the season here. Into the box now, Zach McKinstry. 0 for 1 with a run scored thus far. The 1-1. One, one. Lifted in the air to right field. Fowler giving chase, but he won't get to it, and this should put a man in scoring position to start the inning. And he'll pull into second here with nobody out. Chris Ladies Taylor will get the call here Ladies as he'll hit for the pitcher. He's hitting for the Dodgers. Number three, Chris Taylor. This one runs a little too far in. Ball two. A swing and a ground ball to third. Oh, and it eats him up a bit. Up next to the top, the third baseman. Justin. To the plate now, Justin Turner. In the dirt here. Good work there to prevent any advance. It's one and two. Open to send him packing. Pitch on its way. Now the fastball is right by him as he swings and misses for the first out of the now inning. So it's a tight spot here. First and second. One man out. And striding to the plate will be Corey Seager. Long for one. On to Goldschmidt and it's in time. A double play and the side is retired. Double 
Scott Alexander gets the call from the pen to take over on the mound and start the home seven. Here's Colton Wong now. No hits in three tries so far. He struck out once. Even though we're moving into the back end of this game, they're only down by a couple of runs. You know that old slogan, a bloop and a blast? They could certainly use that right now. And that misses ball four. It's a leadoff walk to start the home seventh. Hard sinker misses two and two. Alexander is among a dying breed. Those lefty specialists whose roles are changing with the new rules around reliever usage. Pulls this one in the air out to left. Betts has a read on it. One out. And that brings up Paul Goldschmidt. He comes in 0 for 2 thus far. The first baseman, Paul Goldschmidt. 1-1. One, one. Goldschmidt swings and hits this one very well out to deep left field. That one is out of here. This game is tied. At the plate, Matt Carpenter. And it's up to a 3-2 full count now. And he lays off, ball four. Now the potential go-ahead run is on base here. Ross Stripling enters to make an appearance on the mound as he inherits a runner at first with one out in the inning. Paul DeYoung will be the first to greet him here as he'll stand in with a runner at first and one away. From the stretch. Ball three. When you're playing close games like this, base runners mean everything, so he can ill afford to start giving away free passes. Heading out towards shallow right. Bellinger's under it. Two down. Here's the catcher, Yadier Molina. Comes into this at bat 0 for 1 in the ballgame. Two out with the possible go-ahead run at first. Fouled away. The 2-2. Now a swing and he gets him to pop it up. Will this be a big out out of the bullpen? McKinstry is there and the side is retired. Andrew Miller has been summoned from the bullpen as he'll do so to start the eighth. Number 21, Andrew. So that'll bring in Mookie Betts. He's working on a one for three thus far. Bounce towards the mound. Throw on to first in time, so the leadoff man is set down to open up inning number eight. So now it'll be the four-hole hitter, Cody Bellinger. He singled his last time up. The 1-1. Takes a pass and misses. That's strike two. Belted high and deep into right center. Back goes Thomas. On the warning track, he makes the catch. And that'll bring Not up the versatile the Max Muncy. He's got a hit in three at-bats to this point. One and one. Here it is. I got two one Hits are even at seven apiece. And there's a fastball well off the plate inside. Full count now. And another foul ball. Here's the payoff pitch. Frozen on the fastball. Never had a chance, and the inning is over. Pedro Baez goes on to pitch out of the bullpen in the bottom half of the eighth. 
number 52. Bottom of inning number eight set to go. Digging in, Tyler O'Neill. He's working on a one for three thus far. And he lays off, ball four. Now the potential go-ahead run is on base here. Ready for another chance? Lane Thomas. He went down on strikes last time up. Sometimes you just got to tip your cap to the guy on the mound. He's getting paid to try and get you out as well. Anytime it gets up there north of seven, eight pitch ABs, sometimes it just comes down to pure execution. Let's see if he makes the adjustment right here. And he lays off, so it's full now, three and two. Fastball swung on and missed as they set him down for the second time here tonight. Jairo Munoz come on to pinch hit here in a big spot. Before the delivery, a check on that go ahead run at first. Possible go ahead runs on first, one away. It's fouled away. Here he comes on a ball and two strikes. Swing and a miss on the changeup, and there are two gone. So it's a runner at first with two men out, and that'll bring up Colton Wong. Ground ball sent back up the middle, and that gets through, so he'll have his first base hit, making one for four in the game now. Now back, right fielder, Victor. And now Dexter Fowler. And he fouls this one off. The 2 2. Now he goes the other way, and he got a lot of it high and deep to left center field. But that'll stay in the park as it's off the wall. The runner from first crosses the plate. Now a 5 3 game. Stepping in now, Paul Goldschmidt. Now a ball lined to the left side. But this is a foul ball. And a slider called strike three as he couldn't pull the trigger, and the side is retired. Giovanni Gallegos comes on from the pen, hoping to finish this one off here in the top of the ninth. Now at the plate, Jock Peterson. He reached on a fielder's choice previously. Looking for base runners here as they're down two playing on the road. Not an easy thing to do, trying to score runs or bunch hits together off of a closer. And this pitch misses here. It's ball four, and they've got a leadoff base runner aboard to start the ninth. Whoa. The one two is a wave and a miss. He struck him out. Trying to pick things up where he left the off. Back. Zach McKinstry. It was a two bagger yeah. for him in his last at bat. And he's got to build off that last AB. He battled. Usually when you battle, you get in that swing mode. A lot of pitches. You'll swing at the rosin bag. I love the fact that he was able to work a double in last at bat. Let's see if we get more of the same right here. Here now the 2-2. Two -two. We could see the runner in motion here on a 3-2 count with one out. There's a pretty good chance he's going to get a pitch to swing at, and if not, it's ball four anyways. Fouled off. Oh. 
Oh, and he can't catch up to the fastball as he swings and misses for the second out. Matt Beatty will be called upon here to hit with the game on the line. Two out with the man at first. And this will be a called strike two. And trouble now as they're down to their final strike tonight. The Dodgers down to their final strike. And he lays off it to even the count two and two. Now this crowd right around 35,000 strong on their feet. Line to the right side. A dive and oh he can't hang on. So now they'll have two men in scoring position following the two out double. Now time is called and a bit of a curious decision here to say the least as we'll get a pinch runner at third here. Don't know if something's wrong or what. At the plate now Justin Turner taking called strike two and now they're down to their final strike tonight. Struck him out, so he'll strand the possible tying run at second, and a great job of working out of trouble as this ball game is over. It's always nice to give your fans at home something to cheer about, and they definitely did that right here, coming through with a big win at home. And this evening's contest comes to a close, 5-3 the final. The St. Louis Cardinals came through late, taking the lead in the eighth to secure the victory. Andrew Miller claims the win out of the pen his first. Giovanni Gallegos strikes out the side to record the save his fourth of the season. So that's a wrap here tonight. For Mark DeRosa, Dan Pleszak, and Heidi Watney, this is Matt Vaskersian. You've been watching MLB The Show. For more, find us on Twitter at MLB The Show. for the victorious St. Louis Cardinals. Five runs on nine hits, one error.